Hey what's up guys my name is Viren and welcome to IFL Pro Before starting video I want to say sorry if quality of this video is not up to the mark because as you see after updating to this beta version Final Cut Pro is not working for me Anyways let's talk about the update so the build number of this beta version is 20A 5364E and size was 3.29 gigabytes so the first update is for iMac 2020 users beta 6 is now supported for it so if you are using older beta version of mac os big sur then you are good to go with this update next is about the airdrop issue while sip is enabled some users were having an issue using airdrop in beta 5 it is fixed in this update next is about final cut pro and some third party applications so when you open fcp it shows a pop up message saying you need to update to the latest version it was working totally fine before updating to beta 6 and third party application like backup and sync still shows error with a terminate option and if you want to know about some other application support then do drop application name in the comment section and i will surely reply to them Next is about the keyboard brightness toggle in the menu bar and control center. Earlier there used to be a toggle to turn on and off the keyboard brightness. Now it is updated and you can directly use the slider for the keyboard backlight brightness. Next is about Siri. When you click on Siri it gives you a list of suggestions that Siri can do for you. So there are some new suggestions here but there's one icon which is improper that is of clock and also in Siri search results the icon is improper next is about Safari so in this Mac OS we have option to change background image in Safari Apple added 6 new system background images for Safari Do tell me in comments which background image you like. Next I want to talk about the startup disk. There is no change in startup disk but the disk icon keeps disappearing. I also tried to unlock and make changes but it shows for a second and again gets disappeared. Next I want to talk about the two minor bugs which are not fixed yet. One is about the music toggle in control center. It still shows incorrect time while playing music. And second is about the grey icon text in system preferences. Icon text color should change from grey to black while turning off the dark mode. And it is not fixed yet. So this was all about the new update that is beta 6. Give a thumbs up if you like this video. Thanks for watching and if you are new here then do subscribe for more informational videos like this.